This is James, and that's me right next to him. Have you ever felt a certain way about someone? You know, just a feeling you have about certain people? Yeah, that's what I felt about James. We both weren't exactly from Canada. I moved here when I was a kid, so I mean, I was, as they say, basically Canadian. But James had only been here for a few years. He moved to Canada from Singapore to study. And he was really considering settling down here too when he was done. But he never really put much thought into it. It started off great. We matched on this online dating app and it was awkward. You're James. Yeah. Yep, you said that. But somehow it worked. We were great with each other. We were happy. No, dude. He was happy. Or so I thought. I could never really tell what was on his mind. There was always something bothering him as if he was never as happy as he could be. I wasn't sure what it was, but I sure wish I saw it sooner. It was like James's heart was a million miles away. And as much as I tried, I could never follow him. He used to be so sure about everything. But as much as you don't want them to, things change. He was really good at hiding it. Okay. What do you need help? You can start by washing these. Can you sit there? Mm -hmm. I thought about going back, you know, just for a visit. Oh yeah. Are you okay with that? Oh yeah, I'm fine. You okay with that? Yeah. How long is a while? Um, you know, just, just a while. Yeah? Okay, yeah, it's fine. It's all right. And that's when things started going down. I used to think we were close. But we were moving farther, and farther apart. And then things got bad. Hey. Hey. Hey, big. Yeah. I gotta tell you something. Yeah. I've decided to go back home. Like, you mean, like, Singapore? Yeah. Oh, okay. Look, uh, look it has nothing lie. to do with you, okay? Does it, have, like, no, no, does it have something to do with your permit? Like, because we can figure that out. Like, my no, dad no. was a really good lawyer, and no, we listen, can make it- Listen. I only have a month left, and that's barely enough time to apply for a new permit, okay? So, you're, you're saying that you don't have any choice? No, I, I don't have any choice. I just want to ask, did you wait until now, like, until you didn't have any time left to tell me that you were for sure going back? Wait, what, what are you saying? Are, are you trying to accuse me of something? Yeah, yeah I, I'm, no, 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 I, I'm just, just wondering, like, you... Conveniently, you have no time, no, no, and now no, no, you've no. made the entire choice. I'm just wondering, it's like... Because it's about me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, okay. It's about you, so what What do you want? Look, what I do have you to want? Back, okay? My mom misses me, my dad misses me, my family misses me, and I miss them. I have to go. Okay. 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 I have your whole life here. Your family is here, your, your friends are here. All right. Okay. Vancouver hasn't done anything for me, okay? It's not impossible. You know, just just give it time. It's going to work. There's no give time. It time! There's no time! Are you listening to me? Okay. Do you know how hard it is for me now? You think this is easy? 
I don't think it's easy. Like, you, hey, I've told you, my parents came to this country. Like, I am two not decades your ago. parents. Yeah, but it's possible. You can make something here. You can live here. Just don't stand in front of me and act like it's impossible. When it. You, you have been here for most of your life. How long have I been here, huh? Three years. That, that's not enough time, okay? I don't have enough time. I just sit, please. I, 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 no, calm. Just please calm down. I am calm. No, you're not. Just. What I'm trying to say is I don't have any other choice. This is not about you. This is not about Vancouver. This is about me, my choice. Okay. So he's gone now, and I'm back to being alone. I tell myself that I should be lucky that I even had him at all, even if it was just for a moment. And I am glad that James is happy. Everybody deserves to be happy wherever that is.